When you installed Zotero for Firefox, you also had to install a plugin for Word. You'll know you did that correctly if you see the Zotero tab. You don't have to have your Zotero library visible, but you will need to have your Firefox browser open. When you want to insert a citation into the text of your document, select the Add Edit Citation icon. When adding the first citation, you'll be prompted to select a citation style for your document. If you don't see the one you want, refer to our handout or the Zotero documentation for how to install more citation styles. Once you've selected the citation style, a red Zotero search box appears. Start typing an author's name or a word from a title and select the item you need to cite from your Zotero library. If you need to add a page number, once you've selected the item, press the space bar, then type the page number and press enter. Another way to add citations to a document is to use the Classic View. Open Classic View by clicking on the Z in the red Zotero search box and selecting it. You can browse your Zotero library in Classic View, and it also has options for other things like including a page number or citing multiple sources. When you're ready to add the bibliography, Place your cursor at the appropriate spot in the document and click on Insert Bibliography from the Zotero tab. There are two types of mistakes you might need to fix when writing and citing. If you made an error when adding an in-text citation, such as citing the wrong page, highlight the citation, and then from the Zotero tab, click on Add Edit the Citation. Then click within the citation bubble and make the change. If there is an error in the bibliographic information stored in Zotero, such as the author's name, title, or item type, you must go back to your Zotero library and edit the item there. Then return to your document and click the refresh icon from the Zotero tab. Pay attention to the changes you've made. Any changes you made in your Zotero library will now be reflected in your document. You never want to type over or use backspace on any text Zotero has added to your document. That breaks the code Zotero uses behind the scenes and causes problems.